race which features three men who have been world champions in their career. Former Paralympic champion as well, and reigning Asian Games champion. Gold already in the 100 meters here, and silver in the four for the three times world champion from Doha last year, Brent Lakatos of Canada. In lane seven for Korea. Silver in the 100 meters in the Asian Games. He went out in the semis of the one and the four here. Young Dong Ho of Korea, the reigning Asian Games champion. And the Paralympic Games champion in this in 2008. In London, he won gold in the 200 and the 400. It's Li Huzhou of China. The man has been winning major championship medals since 2000. Gold in the 200 in Sydney. And gold in the two and the eight in the uh, Swansea Europeans in 2014. That was Pierre Fairbank of France. Gold in the 400 here and silver in the one for Paya Pongsakorn of Thailand. Fifth in the five, seventh in the four, 13th in the 1500 meters. It's the reigning marathon world champion and the world champion over eight from 2013, Josh George of the United States. From Kuwait, gold in the 400 meters in Athens. Hamad al Adwani of Kuwait. From the United States, fourth in the four and the eight in the World Championships out of Brooklyn. Brian Seaman of the United States. Fifth in the four and seventh in the one here. George, the former world champion. Pio, the 400 champion. Lakatos, the 100 champion. Meet in the final of the 800 meters. Seaman in one, Aladwani two, George three, Pio four, Fairbank five, Lee six, Young seven, and Lakados in lane eight, who shot out way in front. Good work from Fairbank in the light blue of France. Skips in front of Lee. Lakados hits the front. The man who finally won a Paralympic gold in the 100 meters, but silver in the four behind Pio, and he'll be looking to make a good move as well. Little shift on the inside from Fairbank Lakados alongside in second place good work from uh, Simon of the United States shooting out on the outside and the tie tucked into the moment here we go the tie going firmly out on the outside there's the bell Fairbank going out in front Lakados fighting hard for Canada as well Seaman stuck on the inside. Little bit of work coming also from Pio. Now he's moved up on the outside and also for China, it's Lee. It looks as if it's gonna be very, very tight. It couldn't be anything else than that. Pio going on the outside. Lagano stuck on the inside. Right behind Fairbank of France. As they hit the bend, the former European and world champion, Pierre Fairbank, is gonna have to fend them up from all sides. He might just do it. Payo's coming on the outside, and he's gonna take it. He's got it again, Fairbank in second place. I'm not sure Lagados even took third in the end, but Payo bumps the torn of Thailand. That's the 400-800 double for Thailand. The 19-year-old, 140.78. Fairbank in control for a lot of that. But it's a silver medal for the Frenchman. He was looking for his first Paralympic gold since 2000. And Lakatos did take the bronze. He just squeaked it. 141.09. Seaman, 200th behind in fourth place. But Fairbank looked for a long time as if he was doing everything right. And then Paya Bongsa Torin, who must have gone out into lane four, had other ideas for Thailand. Here he comes. Fairbank just missing out in the end. Pio gets it. And Lakatos on the outside did take third narrowly from Seaman and four and George five. Well, there's no doubt about them. The team from Thailand, they just know when to come into the race at the right time. And that was perfect from Pio. They have the strength as well to their credit, but the 19 year old has shown so much maturity there and has out think them with Fairbank also getting tired had to do plenty of the heavy lifting 
but well. it was a terrific win by Payo and hasn't he had a tournament winning the 400 silver medal in the 100 and now the gold medalist in the 800 and that's still with a relay to come the 4x400 four and Payo has two golds and a silver now Lakados the complete set a gold silver and a bronze for Canada and Fairbank well he was almost in the same position as Marcel who going out in the front and almost able to smell the gold medal he won the 200 meters at Sydney 2000, but no Paralympic gold since. And look at Bayo Go, the teen sensation from Thailand, rockets out in front, and they have another gold medal. It's been a great game for Thailand, just as it was in the World Championships last year. And Bayo strikes again. That is gold number four for Thailand here. It's his second. And in the last two global games, magnificent. And look at the reaction of Fairbank. Furious that the golds evaded him. Pio takes it, 140.78.